I'm Captain Jones. I'm on the Jones. Still jamming. You, 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 you. Everything came together in a booth. In a booth. Years later, and it's still in a booth. Do a podcast with the interviews. Can you stop what we're finna do? Got a resume rolling in the limousine. Got a son for the king, son for the queen. And we got a winning team. About to do the thing. And then we hit it with a bottle boom, bottle beat. You know what it is when we in the booth. Speaking to the host, speaking to the you. And no matter what, we don't tell the truth. See time happens, you can see the fruit. Join us in the booth today. Please like, share, and subscribe to the show on Facebook, YouTube, and all podcast platforms, including Spotify, Apple, and Google Podcasts. Boom, 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 boom. Too late. If you would like to sponsor boom, the show, boom, 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 boom. <laughs> too late. <laughs> Your eyes get so big when you hit that 808. <laughs> Y'all both be looking stupid. Yeah. Uh, if you like to sponsor the show, just hit us up. Uh, or advertise, hit us up at in the booth pod at gmail.com. Come, come. What you got? Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. The, the cupcake, bro. What you uh, got? It's going there, up, baby. Brother. Uh, November 11th is called Jazz and Jokes. Mine is Jazz oh, and Jokes. Jamming. November 11th, uh, $30 at the door, man. 18 and under, get in free. Alexis Spite, amazing singer. If y'all hadn't heard her, Google that girl. She's amazing. All right. Uh, Vernon Messam. And the jazz quartet, 1KP son, gonna get some hip hop on. And the lovely Ramona Estereo. That was that French again. Yeah, he started calling. Show Lockett, committee show Lockett. boys. Small fire will be in the building, baby. And yes, sir. The Pastor Kaiser will be playing games. Stop playing these games. Stop playing these games. It's, it's going up, man. We'll see y'all there. 18 and under, man. Stop trying to sneak people in. That's 19. You know, don't sneak them in. Let them pay. They're 19. All right. All right. It's going up. Yo. All right. Yeah. We got a lot of topics today. We have Jazz, who's eating a cupcake. Yeah. But man. And making a mess. Yes. What's trending today, Jazz? Yeah. Well, I- <laughs> <laughs> Please, Jesus, right. Well, we got a few things to talk about. We're going to bring it to the congregation. Uh, <laughs> if you really want to know about... I'm just kidding. Okay. Well, Heavenly I'm gonna sh- Father. <laughs> Father. The first thing I'm going to show you today is a video. It's a song called... What's it? F and F? Uh, can't really say what it's... Yeah, it's It's fine. called F... It's like the whole sentence is bad. But, you know, everybody knows the song. So they did a remake about... um. Abortion. So we're just gonna Remake play it. about abortion. And That's different. Don't be disturbed because it's disturbing. Okay. Hmm. Let go. Hmm. I, I can't. We just let's just stop it there. On the way to plan, on, on the way to the clinic, Candace. I got I got murder on my mind. Do I mean do you, I? Do you have words? I don't have them. I real I don't have them, and I am waiting for someone that feels that they are a better representation of black culture to speak out against okay. this. Hmm. So Wait, what it, 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 what is I song? didn't record it right. My bad. So what it is, is basically these two girls, they're, um, they're twerking in front of the Planned Parenthood um, uh, facility. And, and rapping. And rapping about being baby free, but basically saying that they got pregnant and they about to go to an abortion clinic and they got murder on their mind. Oh, wow. Right. right. So that's so the lyric. I got murder on my mind. And they're in front of the clinic doing a video. Hmm. Yeah. And, and that's about murder and the baby. Yeah. Yeah. See, so this is, this is what I said. When, when Candace Owens stick to the culture, we good. Because this is what needs to be addressed and kicked out of our culture, like the nonsense and the shenanigans. Who, who are these artists? I don't even know their name because she didn't even mention their names from the because I can never find the yeah. original yeah, video. It's it's somebody the the song is actually a remake. 
somebody else made the song, and then somebody did a uh, what is it? Right. A, uh, uh, what's what's, what's the word I called? I can't think um, of the word either. Um, when you uh, uh, re- is it? A, it's not a remake. Much, not remake, but you you do that song. They same concept, but it's different. Yeah, words. I can't think what's of this? cover to oh, cover. Yeah, they covered oh, cover. their song. Yeah, but it's like a, a, it's like a parody. Not a parody, no, like a... Because the other version. song is about being single and not having to deal with dudes and being single and being outside in the streets or whatever. Like, it's supposed to be yeah. like a fun type song because I can't say the title because it's just, you know. Ratchet. But that's, yeah, it's a little ratchet song, but it's cool. But they remade it and made it about having an abortion and talking about having murder on their mind. And like, how many views that? does this thing have? I know I it's... think it, it's got over about 200,000, I think, right now. And it just came out? Uh, I want to say it's probably been out for about a month or so, but she, yeah, super insistent. Like, it's just, I don't it's even bad. know what to two say. Girls, two it's, girls, two yeah. girls. Two yeah, girls. One girl, she bad. basically got a, because the video, I don't know why they record right, but the video is, she literally is like in a thong just shaking her butt the whole time while the other girl is rapping about having murdered her mind about abortion. 16,000 views. 16,000. I saw another no, one. That's, had just like one a, that's just one video. It's, yeah, I saw another yeah, one that had like 200,000 views. Like, wow. yeah. it's It came out yesterday? A month ago? No, I think no. it came oh, out a minute ago. ago. Yeah. I'm way behind. I'm way behind. Yeah. Way late. No, but I feel like a lot of videos we see, it be old, but until it goes viral. And this viral. is based on what happened with um, Roe, not Roe, it was Wade. What is it? Um, Roe v. Wade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah that's the whole abortion month, thing about your ago. body and all that stuff, but I mean, it's just tacky, honestly. It's tacky. It's and a, it's and, us. Why gotta be us? I don't understand Nobody why that else. was even cool to do that song right. like that. Like to me, who like to come up with that idea and think that's hot? Somebody had to agree with you, the producer. I'd be like, yeah, let's put this out. How like, young are these girls? Like they look young. They're, they're not like, old. Yeah, they're either early early twenties or nineteen. Yeah, probably like early twenties. Yeah, but it, it, the whole thing is is we have cancerous content. Yeah. Yeah. And within the culture, and it's not it's, it's not the beat. Kansas, Kansas, Candace attacks the culture instead of the content. That's what I say. Stick to the stick to the content, or attack what needs to be attacked. It's not the beat. It's not the melody. It's what they're saying and what you know, saying what they're doing. The dances, the, all that is what's degrading. It's not the music itself. Because from what I've seen, I don't think Kansas. Kansas, Candace Owens <laughs> really listens to sister digs, named Candace. Yeah, yeah. digs <laughs> any hip hop at all. Like, I don't think she do hip hop at all. So it's not hip hop, it's the content. But I mean, besides just gospel rap and kingdom, is there any? I mean, it's, you got to go back to, to try to get good content. Do you content. notice white communities? The bank yeah. comes in. What? what is this? What was that? Sorry, I was trying to put, get the other video up. I ain't know what's going to Okay. If you know, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Who is that? Yeah. Technical uh, difficulties, y'all. That's weird. I mean, I, I feel like I, I need to watch the video. It was the, the murder on, on my mind for me. Yes, yeah, yeah. that's horrible. Yeah, it uh, uh, But, I, you know, I want to watch the video to see, to draw my own conclusion. Yeah. I mean, I guess twerking mm-hmm. is twerking, a butt is a butt. You a butt know, is a butt. Can I play from my A butt is still a butt. Right. Okay. So, I mean... But I still wanted to see kind of uh, the feel, the feel it's for it's it. a butt. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, so um, these are girls that's this. This is not a these girls that signed to a record label or something like that. They just I don't doing think fun so. I think music. They're just doing, you know, they're just, just to get that. likes and views. Yeah, whatever. yeah. they definitely got okay. that. Yeah. I mean, okay. you know, some people just need attention, whether it's good or bad. Yeah, you cover a song. Like, if Jay-Z come out with a song, and I did a song to his song. Yeah. And I'm an artist, you know, and I put it out, and it just... It just went And the girl song yeah. that they redid, she's very hot right now. She's super hot. Okay, yeah. Okay. Who's the girl? Uh, Isn't it Gorilla? Glo- Glorilla. I always say her name wrong. Glorilla. Glorilla. That's it right here. Yeah. Okay, the world, world can't see I that. I don't want you to see. Okay. You can at least hear Let's go. I got murder on my mind. She's spelling aborting. Ain't no baby coming out of me. Yeah. Like, 
if that ain't demonic, because you basically killing the baby in yourself. Yeah, yeah, right. You're killing your own child. Yeah, yeah. So You're making a song about it. But like I mean, I, I, it is the it is the it's the culture that don't want the responsibility yep. of raising the child. You know, and and, re, and refuses to destroy the recklessness to even get pregnant. Right. You're going to throw your body around. I'll throw your that's body seeing, away. They, they, that's sin first, not, and then you got to double down and kill somebody. They're not uh, worried about AIDS and HIV. Like nah, that's that what I'm saying. It's recklessness, and then it's murder to cover up the recklessness. Oh. Yeah. So that... that, that but they just... They bold nowadays. Bro, bro they yeah. bold dog. They happened to... Dog. How did we get from MC Light to this? Right. Money, bro. Money. How did we get from Queen Money. Latifah the because, internet. to this? Be, because for yeah, one, the internet you can see everything, everything I'm doing now. For one, if you see the success of other people, you're gonna start uh, doing what they do, and then you Modeling gotta take whatever it a, they did to You gotta take famous. it a step further. Yeah. And all the great, you know, keep your head up type of songs, they start stop ignoring. And mm -hmm. uh, and uh, to be honest with you, ratchetness got hotter and hotter. You know, more the more flesh you show. Uh, the more more numbers you get, and that's you know that's what people. So if it's about money, the Bible says the love of money is the root of all evil. If it's about money, people are willing to do anything for money or the potential of money or the likes or the shares and all that type of stuff for the numbers. Yeah. Really, uh, for the pride of it. Some of it ain't ain't even money. Some of it is just the pride of. Man, look, we got this type of likes yeah, and all this stuff. Going on. And let me tell you something. Some of these people, I've been in the studio with people who say stuff they don't really mean. They just need a good lyric or need a shot factor. Oh, yeah, for sure. Or they need, yeah. you know. They need attention. You need some attention more than really, really believing what, what you're saying. saying yeah. Or even you've uh, not gone through it. I, I, I've recorded people that. And they lyrics, they shot up everybody, and they ain't everybody. never shot nothing. Yeah. You if you saying? killed everybody, you'd be in jail, dummy. Or yeah, yeah. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And, so, and, and then he really shot him, just told on yourself. Right. So all That's of this. Is, dumb. Yeah. Yeah. It's <laughs> more yeah. dumb. Yeah. It's more, more dumb. dumb. <laughs> so, so, uh, so a lot of these narratives that's being pushed, you hear it in the song, they're not participating, but you got all these kids that. Hear your lyrics. Or influence. Yeah, that's crazy, man. That's crazy. That's yeah. What's the next what one? What else you got? Yeah, yeah that's Pie? weird. That's weird. Wow, wow, wow. By the way, these cupcakes are pretty man, good. Man, these I'm cupcakes are so good. Yeah. Small cakes, grab oh you one. Small cakes. I just had grab the wedding one, cake. Go get and one. And that was. I'm talking about that red belt with hitting them. Go man. get one. You ready? Thank you, Cam. Is you ready? Do you notice yeah. white communities the bank comes in? He and what? then before you know it, comes in what all right this is the topic do you notice white communities the bank comes in and then before you know it they got the school the hospital the supermarket Absolutely. the manufacturing industry the bank is the center of the white community not the church in the black community it's the church and why do i have an issue with that it has nothing to do with religion it's politics the church takes from us but it doesn't give back. It's not an economic recycling engine. I agree. We give the black church $14 million every Sunday, Charlemagne. Mm -hmm. $14 million in the every Sunday. If you're giving the black church $14 million nationally every Sunday, how do you explain those schools? Right. How do you explain those jobs? How do you explain those hospitals? That type of money? Black America is the richest black nation on earth. There's only nine nations above us. We're number 10. And all the other nations, none of them are black. So we're the only African population that has the ability to save itself. We all we need. But we choose not to do it. You notice white community? Mm. Man, that's good. That's interesting. That's good stuff. I that's wanted to get your take on that one. Uh, uh, I, one thing is the dynamics are different, which you just explained. Yeah. Because uh, Passion City in Buckhead raised a million dollars in two services. Yeah. And that's a white church, so... Fourteen million in the black church is it's not a lot. It's of a money. drop in right. the white church. So, just understand and that about dynamic year. first. Yeah, and 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 to me, uh, I actually think it's more than that. You know. Oh yeah, it's more. Than it's way million. more than fourteen. He might have been talking in, in the city. You, you might have been talking Sunday. about one judge because I know a judge that pulls yeah. in. Yeah. 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 And, Here. And yeah. Um, you know, a lot. Of, and uh, Pastor Creflo Dollar got a lot of flack 
uh, about you know them having money or preaching prosperity or what have you. But what they don't know is he would give a lot of jobs to guys who didn't have jobs, and they were not doing anything. <laughs> right. yeah. And they would, I mean, you got a hundred guys on the maintenance. Yeah. You know, it, it, 30 of them in there trying to get 10 chairs. Yeah. And so, <laughs> it, 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 and, and, I, and I used to observe. Uh, Duggar, vacuum one room and take a 30 minute break. Right. Yeah. Right. Duggar, I, I used around to, doing nothing. I, I used to observe, and, and he had guys on uh, first shift in the morning, second mm-hmm. shift, and then midnight shift. He, he, he had those guys there 24 hours. Just to get them, something. take them off the street yeah. and give them something to do. Mm-hmm. And, and so he's, he helped a lot. A lot Nobody want to talk about that. A lot of yeah. people don't show Pastor uh, Cruffo love for that, but he, he took a lot of guys off the street and showed them a lot of love on, the, on, on maintenance and giving them uh, little jobs and stuff. And so, you know, there are people that uh, do community their way. They give away a lot of stuff, too, in the community. Mm-hmm. You know, so a lot of stuff. A lot and of I time, think when... when a lot of times when black churches get to that point, they can do that. But most black churches are trying to just pave the parking lot. Or, or, survive, you know, yeah. right. or, because survive, you are yeah. a church yeah. but based we, off of the, the community that yeah. you're yeah. pulling from. But, yeah. but what I'm saying, when, when the Creflo's, the, 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 the New Burbs, and the TDJ, when they get to a certain point, then they're able to pour out right. more into the community like the you know the And then when churches. they get there, then, then people are stoning them. Yeah. And nobody's stoning... That. Uh, Andy Stanley for 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 his prosperity yeah. and for having five huge, you know, I, I, I thought it was five, but it yeah. was, but I mean you got campuses now, yeah. not churches, churches, Camp- campuses, bro. Yeah, like drive around campuses. Yeah, and so it's like nobody's talking about that, but but it, you know, and he may say that we don't put the money back into our community, but our community sometimes when you're trying to just get a float, especially me as a pastor, understanding everybody is ki- one. You got Part of everyone trying to pull the life out of you, you know, anything mm-hmm. you get, everybody needs something, and mm-hmm. you're trying to help save everybody. That's one thing. Then you got the other part of it. Still, I'm still in my race. I ain't went white yet. I ain't gone to Spanish. I'm, I'm still in my race. <laughs> then you got the other folk beating you up. You know, you mm-hmm. did. Got to be stealing. They, they had it. Mm-hmm. You got all of that. They really so, be mad because they can't take advantage. And That's I'm trying. Really and, and, and so yeah. sometimes, man, a leader. You know, especially one man, just get tired, bro. You get tired, and you, you know, you, you know, not that you don't want to try, but you just get tired of fighting your own people, you know, and 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 trying to fight this, this thing that if y'all if we ain't struggling as a church or struggling as a neighborhood, then we got to be doing something wrong. Right. Yeah, it's like they like you. You got to be still. Yeah. You got to be still. It's like pack. I'm cool with you if you struggle. Yeah, they have more sympathy. Just for don't you get out of this spot. Yeah. And we ain't gonna have no problem, right? Because the moment you buy the block, then I got an issue. But and that's, that's and, and that's the voice of a black man most of the time. Like, why why would you not want him to buy all of this land, right? For us, for, for us. That's right. what I'm saying. Like, like I, I'm like like the psych, psychological. Like in your mind, your thinking process. How do you get to the point where you want him to stay in the storefront? A lot you, of a lot of people. Like, you, you a lot care. of people is you left me. Mm-hmm. And I'm I'm. I'm Tell and you. now it's you didn't want to move. You, le- you me. left me. You didn't want to grow. With you me. didn't want to no. grow. When I, I'm telling you, I, you know, I don't even want to say names, but a lot of people got mad. I mean, you know, you walked in here today, something was different. So you already know I'm going to change something. You know, I, I'm with Every growth day. and progressing. You know, I'm not with staying the same. Uh, I don't subscribe to autopilot. Uh, one one man of God said, uh, yeah. uh, you know, I was like, how's, how's the ministry? Oh, man, we good. We in autopilot. And he was gone mm-hmm. the next month. So I never say that. <laughs> There's a journey with God that you're always on. There's no and destination. You, and you're Just... never on autopilot. And so I understand that. And so, but when you're growing and you're improving, then you got people hating sometimes, you know. Sometimes they're internal. Sometimes they're on assignment from the devil to knock you off your block. And so it is tough that, okay, we got $14 million, but, man, you know, eight of them is for this. So <laughs> nine of, you know, we, we doing certain things, bro. Like, like, why make it negative, you know, 
we started our own school, so we couldn't put money into the uh, public school. We started our own school. True. You know, and so, and so there are certain things that people are trying to do to try to help improve the neighborhood, but, you know, you are fighting your culture most of the time, especially the church, especially the church. They got something to say about what we're trying Everything. to do. Mm-hmm. You know, whenever there's something, whenever you... You you bigger or you make a name like there's never a problem on the white side with it with with, with them becoming that big. But when Creflo Dollar when uh, uh, Bishop Long was here at that time, he was uh, prospering and different people get big. It's a it's an issue. I you know? saw um on on uh... or, or or let me say this. or we can only have one guy. Yeah, at a time. Yep. Yeah. I saw a, a comic, not a comic, but a, a somebody drew something and it was a tree and it was. Two white guys and two black guys, and they were both like two, like a white guy and a black guy were going into the tree, and then the other two guys were standing down, and they both had their hands around the respective uh, people, but one was pushing, and then one was pulling down. And I was like, this speaks volumes. Yeah, yeah. Like, why? Why is that? Why do we feel like? But we we're here to change it. I think the dynamic of the, uh, the dynamic of we've been in survival mode for so long. That's it's it's really it's it's it it's a That's an excuse. it's it's a um, social economic dynamic is really what it is is you have one side that has you it's know thriving. yeah they're thriving let's just say what yeah it is. yeah, yeah. if you're thriving and you come up in that culture it's like okay we all gonna thrive we all gonna get it this culture only so many people gonna get it. that's what they feel like it's like okay only so many people gonna get mm-hmm. it out and somebody gonna get left behind so okay. Let's Whoever all fight. look like it's it's gonna move, it ain't okay. Let's push them. It's like, well, if it ain't me, you ain't, ain't leaving it you. right. It, yes, I'm saying Grabbing so. The bucket, I'm saying, yeah, yeah, so it's yeah. that it's a sociological economic dynamic that creates that. I don't think it's a skin color thing. It's just that dynamic creates like, okay, who gonna make it out the hood or who who from the family going you know, and it that's who gonna make it to college. Yeah, yeah. and and who on gonna, the other side, they like everybody gonna make it we got a trust fund we have you know like you said when you said that y'all can go to college and they was like what like what, what? we've been like yeah we, and like that, and you're speaking to a different dynamic which is weird to them you yeah. know it's like but, and, but it, we shout on this side right. let somebody go to college yeah. let somebody get a scholarship Ooh, free ride oh thank you jesus yeah. thank you jesus yeah you know but that's you made it out it's it's expected and one to mm-hmm. expectation it's, it's a it's, miracle, it's a miracle. Yeah. yeah and i and i can't mm-mm, i don't subscribe to that yeah. so right. i have expectations and uh, my belief system had to change uh, I, I the way i believe is different um some people have to just believe like they have to just work their belief muscles to just believe for something to believe in god but then there is a belief system that make that 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 builds your world you know so you can you can be a very faithful person but still living in the hood you can be a very uh spiritual person but but the benefit of it uh uh you don't get because the the necessary moves that need to be made either you don't know or you don't make them and so that's the that's the one thing that god has blessed me with uh above any talent is hustle Mm. like i'm finna just make it happen no we ain't going to let it happen. It ain't going to be no if it's going to happen. Mm-hmm. I'm going to make this junk happen. This is going to yeah, happen. Make your way prosperous. Yeah, 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 the, the, yeah the, the scripture says uh, make your way prosper, uh, prosperous and you will have good success. Right. But but there are people that feel like this is a Russian roulette life. Yeah. That some people get it and some people. And, that, and I understand you just have to hustle. And you got your faith, but you still have to hustle. Like you still got to make moves. Mm. You still you can't just get knowledge and mm. make no moves. And say God gonna do it. Right. Yeah. There are a lot of people. There are a lot of people that know a lot of stuff, and they 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 sit right next to the dude that don't don't know no, nothing. Yeah. Like you very brilliant in your mind, but the the dummy is your neighbor. That means you haven't made any moves. And so sometimes you got to spend your own money. Sometimes you got to try something else. You know, it's amazing that. Everybody feels like in order to get money, you got to sell dope. How in the world does everybody think that same thing when when 
There are so many choices in all mm-hmm. other cultures, but our cho- our culture, you yeah. can either play football, football basketball, yeah. or drugs. You, 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 or you rap, something. you do music. Rap, mm-hmm. which you got to do drugs to get to before Somebody you get gotta, on. Yeah, yeah it's funded and, and, by drug and, money. And so. so the whole thing is, don't you understand that you, you're in a trap? And, and like, not the nine times out of ten, if they pull you over, they probably going to smell weed because it's in the car. You know, mm-hmm. because that's what... This culture does, and so we. That's why. That's why we're kingdom culture. We're hip hop, but we're kingdom culture. That's why. That's why the moves that we make are different and aggressive. And God is taking this culture of free life and growing it, you know, and it's growing very fast. But we refuse to compromise. The other thing is, you got to make moves. You got to. You got to move by faith and not just get knowledge. Because a lot of times people get my people pair perish for lack of knowledge. I feel like that's lack of knowledge of God because you can know a lot of stuff, but if you don't know the right thing, which is not hooked up to God, then you got a lot of knowledge that ain't going to do nothing for you. So the lack of knowledge, knowing the right thing, that's God. The other thing is when God tell you to move, because he's going to always tell you to move. Here's the part where faith uh, and a lot of churches don't produce. That we go to church, we shout. Ooh, we shout. Hey, 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 we shout. But then, dog, on Monday morning, there is no move based on what you heard yesterday or what God told you to do. Yeah. There is no move. So you do it again, do it again, and you keep going to church. And so you're kind of going to church, and you're spiritually deaf, or you or you hear, but you won't do nothing. And so with me, the first thing I heard, whatever it was, I did it. I did it in tears. Because I don't want my to-do list, my kingdom to-do list to stack up. So I just do it. All right? You know, the uh, Lord woke me up, showed me the green screen. That's right behind you. There's a green screen behind you. Mm. I saw it. I was, he woke up. Boom. Th- there's a reason that he wanted there. All right, cool. Every time you put it there, boom, boom. All right, I did it. All mm. right? Don't know the full effect of why, but I know what I saw in my spirit, and I know what I heard in my heart. And and I and it just made it happen. So there there are things that people could do in our community as as pastors, you know. But even believers, parishioners, there are moves that can be made as a people, man, to to advance our our people. But sometimes we won't do it. Yeah. You know, we won't do it. We we're getting ready to vote for certain things and and put per, certain people in office just because we black. No, nah, man, right. you vote kingdom. Right. Yeah. You know, you do what well, God tells you. Yeah. So we always do it we as Democrats. No, nah, bro. You know? and, 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 it's, and it's a curse. It's a curse that's blatant, and we still doing the same thing. No. Nah. Mm. So it's, a, it's, a, it's up to us to change. So in, these dynamics are, are, are amazing. Um, these trending topics are amazing. Yeah, they're good. Um, so... Kudos to Jazz. Go, go, uh, go to the next one. I know you. That, we, we stayed on that one for a long time. No, I expected that with that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so the next one is uh, a series called Hair Tales. It's by um, Tracy Ellis Ross, and it's on OWN Network, but it shows on Hulu. So basically, what the series is about: um, black women and their hair, and how, like, how we went through certain things, how beauty is pain, and how um, we were taught, like you know, to look a certain way sometimes and sometimes that went against what our actual hair texture was. It was it's just all these different conversations about growing up. They even talk about like when you get your hair hot combed or your mama tell you to be still, you getting popped because yeah. she hurting you, but you better not say nothing. You know, stuff like that and how they shaped uh, our culture, shaped us as women, shaped us as black women at that. And it's just a whole bunch of different people. Uh, I know, what's her name? Issa, Issa Rae's on there. Mm-hmm. That she's the second episode. The first episode actually is Oprah, and Oprah's talking about um, how she used to wear. She used to want to have bangs. She used to wear her little hair to the side and would have her bangs and everything. She deals with her bangs because she felt like her bangs gave her strength type type stuff. Mm-hmm. So it's a pretty cool series. And they also go into like a, um, you know how they do the barbershop talk, mm, but they yeah. do it in the beauty salon. Yeah. So yeah. like hair for for women. I mean. You know, a lot a, a lot of guys look at, or black guys look at hair and butt, you know, uh, and f- I guess face come third. You know. uh, I don't know. I'm not a man. Uh, you know, 
It depends on what you're trying. Like, if you're trying to get married, then your face come first. <laughs> <laughs> but if you ain't I trying cannot. to get married, it's, it's I mean, it, it just is what it is. People look at the booty first. Okay. Uh, but, but oh. like, about hair. <laughs> I'm just saying. And then he said booty and hair, which yeah. just yeah. threw me all the way yeah. off. Yeah. Booty hair. Yeah, yeah. that's oh, what I was thinking. Booty hair. Yeah, yeah, I was like, what? Booty <laughs> hair. <laughs> 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 I, I, I think oh, uh, the pr- it's just the pressure. Um, sometimes too, when you are working in corporate America, and your bosses are from a different culture. Uh, y- you feel like you gotta try to look a cl- as close to that culture mm-hmm. as possible, so you start changing. Or what that occupation looks like, as far as what we've seen on TV right. or whatever. Right, right, right. Because I mean, naturally, we we'll all have afros, mm-hmm. you yeah. know, without without chemicals or without mm-hmm. hair relaxers. Everybody will look the same. Yeah, yeah. You, you know, you'll have, but you know, but if you walk into certain places with an Afrocentric look, it might, yeah, it might, it might turn people off mm-hmm. or make people think a certain. There are women that have not gotten hired because of that. Yeah, and that's so that's so unfair. Just because of mm-hmm. your hair, you know, and because they want you to look a certain type of way. So you, so when they're meeting, when you mean their people, they not looking like. Uh, who well, I want to see that every yeah. day. Yeah, who's this person? Is that is that is it fair? Or no, Mm-mm. I. <laughs> it's not. And then we as women. Or some women, because I don't do it, but they they um, classify you. Like it's not even about race anymore. It's about who got the good hair, who got the bad hair. Which, the bad hair, which like, is no is real that? thing, right? It's however you accept your hair, right? Nappy hair. Um, yeah. It's a race on there. She's talking about right. They talked about nappy hair. What's called? Because some people don't like the term. Some people understand it's a part of the culture. And can't nobody else say you got nappy hair? Like nappy hair is nigger for for hair. <laughs> I think it's more of like. When they call the cold, call it nappy. That's just away, more Kathy. kinky. Like it's not straight. But I do like you. Like is that is that is that? Is that I'm saying is that's what they say. You don't want. You can't say nappy now. No. No, yeah, they're saying as far they don't like what the term means. Like how people say good and bad hair. They're like, well, there's no such thing as right, bad what's hair. Right. What's bad hair? So when you're saying nappy, they, they put that as a reference. It's not everybody. Some people they talk to was like, I mean, my mama said my hair was nappy. nappy. Yeah, she was like, when I don't comb it, it's nappy. Like, But other girls were saying, like, I don't like the term because there's no such thing as nappy hair. Like, uh, either you well, they, No, they, uh, what is that term I've heard from another culture? And, uh, tangled? T- tangled up or mm-hmm. not that, but. Knotted? Yeah, some, like Matted? almost like oh, tang- tangled up. <laughs> like, <laughs> that, that need enough. Yes. like man, that's look. I have cried. Oh, we call it peas. Peasy. Okay? Yeah. 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 Boy, you got the old peas head, boy. Yeah. That's what they used to call me. Peas. That's Durant. So <laughs> yeah, the, 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 so Durant hair is not nappy. Durant that's hair, peasy. it just needs uh some clippers. No, no, it just need a, a no, brush. He, I'm about to say he. But I think, care I think he hair. got a. There's something going on. I feel like it hurts to brush his hair. I feel no. like he got enough money to figure it <laughs> I out. I do. I mean, huh? I yeah, feel like you he got, got enough money, money to figure it out. You're not trying, sir. I'm he, sorry. I you think never it get hurts. a pass for me. I think it hurts. Never. So, so it hurts for me to look at it. Could you not? Are you not calling his hair nappy? His hair is nappy. <laughs> 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 I don't care about the term nappy because listen, look, my hair be looking straight when you catch that back of that neck. Like, listen, that's not what that meant. That's not me. But my, my, my hair. Hair. she don't have no My naps. hair gets tangled though. Tangled. Tangled. It does. <laughs> Mad it. <Okay>. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Not, just not. like people see my hair and like, oh, like it looks soft, duh, duh, which it is. You just, it feels soft. But if you get up under there and sweat a little bit, boy, I'd be about to snatch. Yeah, <laughs> you ain't got what I got. No, but when my hair is not straightened, I have, I used to have Afro puffs. So that hair texture is in there. Trust and believe this is trained hair. Okay. Me too. That's your hair. Yeah, but it's trained. Yeah. Years well, ago, you press I, it or you perm yeah, it? Yeah, so you press no, it. No, I have, uh-uh, I'm, I'm natural. I just wear my hair straight more than I wear it, like in the coily hair. Like, cause most people, when they have Yeah, so, see, they think when you wear straight hair, you're trying to be. No, nah, that's just how I like to wear yeah, my hair. Corporate. Or, or you know the other color, the other people. Yeah. Really? Trying to be like, clear. Yeah. yeah. Well, I don't think that's it. I just think you want to do something it's different with your hair. Yeah, that's it. According yeah, to like, like America oh, and you, the you culture, it's always want, more appealing to look at that. If you wear knots, you ain't trying to be black. <laughs> right. Like, I don't want to wear no. bantu knots. Yeah. Yeah, and then I don't want my head is too big for that. Maybe I want. I mean, do something else. I like 
variety. Yeah, I don't say it. And most black women are variety. Lay your hair down, do yeah, something do else. Do that's, the whole, that's the whole cool thing, too. Like, that's what they're talking about. Like, we're not just one thing. We're not just defined by our hair. If anything, our hair tells a whole bunch about mm-hmm. us. Like, yeah. we can do different styles with that same texture hair yeah. and wear it 10 different ways. Yeah, yeah but I, I, I can tell you, oh, you that's, that's that white stuff. You trying to be white. No. Like, <laughs> like, I don't no, think I'm a, just a, trying, a white to woman is trying to be comfortable in my skin. Because right. you get a tan. Exactly. Like, it's just. You know, a filler in her lips. Preference. You know what I'm yeah. Well, so, so yeah. Pre- but yeah, it's a cool series. Preference. You check it out. It's talking. To, I mean, it's pretty dope because a I lot of stuff I related to. With my hair. Cool. You are doing something. That one hair. called naps. Okay. <laughs> All right. So I'm moving around. Yeah. I'm telling you, man. Oh, yeah. grinder. Okay. Naps. <laughs> yeah. Just take a yeah. nap. Hey, you don't have that. Exactly. You don't have nap, ain't? Not right now. Not what right got? now. Huh? What you got? It's short. Yeah, it's just mine too short to be nap. Oh no, it ain't too short to be, be nap. I mean, it ain't nap right now. It's what just you, what you call you, you use a pick. It. Yeah, you pick it out it. and just sponge it. Yeah, yeah. But if I don't do nothing over, t- yeah. you look like the. Di- yeah. I'm not gonna say that. Uh, it'll get. It won't be Kevin Durant, <laughs> but it'll be. <laughs> Kevin Durant ain't gotta be Kevin yeah. Durant. <laughs> it won't be I, Kevin I, Durant. I think that's a superpower. Oh. He's a superpower now. Yeah, He's Samson. Samson. Okay. Man, bro. That just, uh, that the, the <sighs> ball, man. He can play right. ball. Okay, we got to move along. Please. Look, 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 at the look at some of his great games. Okay. Look how nappy his head was. Okay. Mm. Okay. Oh, wow. That's all Tell of them. Me. Okay. I'm just saying. So no, when he no. brushed his hair, he was When he got his MVP, his, his hat was laid. He was, he was, it was straight. I, you know, I was like, oh. Okay. And what did straight look like? I mean, it was brushed. It was oh. nice. Fade. He found his comb. Cool. All right, next. Yeah, leave man. Okay. <laughs> the next uh, story is about Brittany, and she's uh, still Brittany in Griner. Russia, unfortunately. Yeah. Um, her appeal in Russia got denied, and her nine-year sentence is still upheld. Wow. So, basically, what's going on here, you know, she got locked up, and they tried to appeal it. They didn't even go in court. Like, they showed her on the video. She looked so sad. Like, oh it was gosh. almost terrible to watch. And they denied the appeal, and they really don't have no real reason to deny the appeal for real. Now she's been in there since February. Yeah, she's been there for almost a while. a year now. And I'm just like just waiting on somebody to say yes, basically. Yeah, that that whole thing. And, and the punishment does not it, miss, match the crime. Yeah. <laughs> at so all. right now she that, has to say, do to say nine she's years. She's smuggling yeah. over that little bit. You know the, good boy that one smuggling. We are privy only to a piece of what this is about. Mm-hmm. There's a clearly so it's it's a thing of Russia yeah. US. It's not just and I, her. And, I, and I really believe that they want somebody else to be released. Yeah, I'm saying it's a, that's already America said it. is saying yeah. that they've already said that's what it's, it is. It's, yeah. bro, when somebody is at war, you are a prisoner of war. Like you're you're being held because of what's going on. Right. The contention between countries. And uh they want we, we have somebody, I forgot who we have, but we have one of the world's dangerous men when it comes to, you know, uh warfare. Yeah. You know, so, and they're trying to probably use her. Yeah, as a that's what I'm saying. And America don't want to let him go. And 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 that is why that is why the news is getting over here so big, because they're trying to put pressure on voters or or just have the people in anguish over Brittany Griner. But I think it's a bigger agenda. Yep. You know, for holding her. So that's. Man, we're going to pray for her. And they also have, um, they actually tried to offer some things. It says that um, in July, Biden administration offered a prison swap Mm -hmm. involving Ms. Griner. They still didn't turn her over. And also, they said that Russia is definitely not known for turning over their verdicts. But we speak against that. They're going to turn it over for her. She does not deserve. Nobody deserves to be just locked up for no reason. (laughs) And then in they said that the jail. lawyers are trying to, um, you know, go to a higher court, but it's just kind of like it's just really stagnant at this point. So, mm. what do you think? She how is, how do you think she's gonna be when she comes out? Like, I think the ultimate thing she'll she'll feel like she's going straight to church. I'm about to say she'll feel the freedom because yeah. she's not like that's yeah, don't too take extreme. me home, take me to the yeah, church. Like, yeah, like uh, what city she play ball in? DC? What what city? Oh, the Phoenix? Phoenix. Phoenix. All I remember yeah. is Russia right now. Church, there's some churches out there. Yeah. She gonna be some ch- Oh, she's gonna be worshiping, boy. She, she and she's seven feet no, tall, but no, she's gonna lay all the way across the yeah, That ain't no okay. uh you know, get out with good uh behavior. You're right. Oh, that's yeah, a not how this is gonna drag out jail. Yeah, oh god. You doing nine. And it ain't even nah. a thing where you can break out. She gonna she, yeah. she got you nah. can't break out of that. 
because you can't go nowhere. She got you have to get overseas. And I mean, think no about her career. If, if she does serve the nine years. Oh, yeah. No, nah, that's, that's so oh, bad, man. man. Yeah. No, nah, she going to get out. We're praying for you, Brittany. Wow, she got to get out. That's not fair. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Okay. Well, moving right along to Mr. Kanye. Mr. West. Mr. West. Kane West. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, unfortunately, well, I don't want to say. I mean, it's unfortunate, but he's still a millionaire. But he lost his billionaire status. After his Adidas uh, deal nixed, he also lost a lot of um, other companies Balenciaga. that he was associated with. Yeah, yep. uh, including Adidas, Gap. Yeah. Um, he his had Gap bank. Too. I don't know. His bank. Yeah. He had a bank. Oh. No, the bank. Oh, that the he bank. Working with. Yeah. I was about to say. Um, blah blah blah. So, um, he lost several deals, which we said, and. He lost a huge part of his wealth, so I think he's right around four hundred million, which is still a lot. But that but he lost, lost six hundred million. That's what they're saying. So you're saying in worth? Yeah. Yeah. Not in Not cash. Dollar amount. Yeah. yeah. This is what Forbes claims. So it says after this fallout, Forbes claimed that Kanye West's worth is somewhere in the ballpark of four hundred million. This is a huge dip from where he was a couple of years ago, where his net worth was uh, valued at one point three billion. With a uh, majority of his public you're assets, about he lost a billion dollars. That's just in deals. No way. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. Fun. I mean, that's, that's no stuff that's way. you know. For one, uh, if they pulling Yeezys from Adidas, he who gonna wear them other bobos that right. they got? You know? <laughs> <laughs> he probably probably yeah. make a more. He really did but, Adidas but, a favor. Yeah, right. yeah, who gonna wear those? Who gonna wear those? Uh, and then you know they gonna probably try to make some. Bleezies or something like Bleezies. Bleezies. Ain't nobody gonna wear them. Messes, I ain't wearing bro. no bleezies. Gonna Come wear get them. these Adidas bleezies. So the so the so the money that he, <laughs> he's supposed to lose, they gonna lose. Yeah, yeah that's they, that's, they, that's, they gonna, that's a whole more. urban. But market. the thing is, people don't understand that this is what Kanye wanted. He wow. said, I, I'm, I want out of these deals, and I got well, lawyers. He found and a way to get out, didn't he? And he said it twice on um, what interview was that? He said, I can say something anti-Semitic. And they won't do nothing. Then he stopped. He said, I can do say something anti Semitic and they can't it's like He trying to he trying to bait try, it. Yeah. Because he said Oh, he, that that's uh, that that is the interview that he did. That's, that's what he said. That's, 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 yeah, yeah. that's, that's different. That's not when he said the anti Semitic okay. thing, but what he, did he, he say? He, I started yeah. figuring it out. What did he say? He said, I'm going World Def Con three on the uh, uh uh Jews or whatever, you know. Oh, that's what I was like. It had, I he had wanted to expose what the handlers and how it really go, and this, that, the third. But he said that, and it's like, oh, you know, they went through the Holocaust, and you can't say that, and this, that, and the third. But then he said something about George Floyd, and, you know. And he also working with Candace, and I think they had a problem with that. Candace Owens. Well, Candace yeah, is but Can uh, see, Candace, one, ain't it? Candace, again, she don't go with Kanye like that. She it's, her thing is political, so she ain't gonna go. Kanye is on the right; he's conservative, so she ain't going after him. And she tried to kind of backtrack from her <laughs> white lives matter, like trying yeah. to kind of dis. Okay, well, let me see what Kanye's doing first before you know. No, 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 no. Oh, that uh, was her yeah, yeah, she, picture. Yeah, she tried to kind of backpedal, like, to, okay, well, well, let's just wait and see. Like, no, nah, yeah, because nah, 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 y'all nah. got two different kinds yeah, of yeah, money. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, one of y'all nah, can nah, take nah, it. Long money, right. but, yeah. <laughs> but I think Kanye, you don't become a billionaire by being a dummy. Yeah, he's smart. Uh, not at all. He's, he's yeah. He, he want he wants to what he wanted to do was sell direct. He wanted y'all like y'all. Yeah, yeah. yeah. he he wanted to sell that. Everybody and, and they were not them. letting. Yeah, Adidas yeah. not gonna let Yeezy go. Yeah. So he was like, let me say, cause you know, say something to get out and, of this. And and the clothing line that he did is probably gonna be direct. Mm -hmm. Yeah, was, all of it. Gap. Everybody took his stuff out. No, I'm saying the like, cause I didn't see a bigger label on his what he did the White Lives Matter thing. I, that wasn't for a different company. That was for his clothing line, but I didn't see like a Gap or Adidas or something like that yeah. uh, added to it. So he, this probably might be a part of his campaign to be alone because you're right. Uh, if he lose that money in worth and people still trying to get Yeezys, uh, they're trying to get his designs or the value in Yeezys go down because he's not with Adidas and he just leave that all together and make some other shoes, he, he going to make that billion overnight. I'm okay, saying, yeah, right. if it's direct, yeah, yeah. yeah he, I he, mean, he's, 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 he's he basically yeah, he don't have no middleman now. Yeah, I don't say he's like, he, he like they get, they might have made me a billionaire, but they made 
billions off, off of, of me. me. Yeah, so and, if I take my billions back, then okay. Yeah. yeah. He know that Yeezys was keeping Adidas float. Okay. Yes. They said, no, okay, you, for that yeah, you, you, you keeping them. My shoe is keeping you in business. Yeah. And you taking most of the money based off me, right. you know, in my name. Right. I want out. Right. Oh, no, nah, you, you ain't getting out. Okay, watch this. <laughs> I can say something anti-Semitic, <laughs> and they can't do anything. Why are you anything. looking around like that? Because that's how he was looking. That's how it sounds. Like, it was yeah. so odd. When I saw him do that, I was like, oh, that's obvious. I can do something. And he did it again. He said it right. I can say something anti-Semitic. You play too much. And they can do nothing <laughs> about it. He said it twice. I was like, when I saw that, I was like, Oh, he wanted to get, and he said he wanted to get out. But back then, when he was fighting, he was like, "Well, I got lawyers, and you know, da, 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 you know, Kanye, you know, when he gun ho about something, he, I got, you know, we gonna get out." Then he said that I was like, and immediately everybody dropped him. He got out. Yeah. He got out without lawyers. Because most people are not even going to the stores like that no more. No. No, nah, they no. ordered online anyway. So they, yeah, so they gonna order. Yeah, you know, they, uh, you think really think Adidas wanted to do that? Absolutely not. So, no. who made them do that? Their bosses, you know the shareholders, or it's just one or two guys up top that's like, forget that. You know, not but even you know, looking at the numbers. Like They're not even looking at the books if they're going to make that decision without looking at the numbers because Kanye kept these people paid. They're about to find yeah. out. And the urban, like, he was the door to the urban world when it comes to Adidas and the gap because. Nobody is really going to those places yes. from our communities like that. Not the gap. And, mm-hmm. you know, and before we Definitely pay a bill, we're going to buy no. some shoes. Yeah. You know, if folks got seven, eight hundred dollars shoes Well, oh, you got on, clothes, you're going to get shoes. Yeah. Right. Yeah, oh, got, 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 got Yeezys. <laughs> yeah. Make in, a, in, a, in a wheelchair <laughs> on the motor. It may even walking, okay. but he got some Yeezys on. All right. Next yeah. one. Yeah. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. So, yeah. I think. <laughs> the yeah. thoughts and views. Yeah. Right. Can we please just, saying, just go to the next one? This got Yeezys on it. Don't even use them. The like, bro, I don't Kaiser. need these. Yeah. The thoughts Messenger. and views. <laughs> Messenger. Of this but, man, right? Here. But <laughs> it's not necessarily the point is, reflective. Reflective. Yeah, he of is everybody right else where here. he want them to be. <laughs> this man said, <laughs> "You gonna don't say it again?" Nah, yeah, don't say it. it. <laughs> yeah, this man, he where he want to be, man. Yeah, uh, Kanye, wow. you don't you don't get a billion by being a dummy, man. Interesting. Like a lot of people going crazy. And oh, they said, and they said, and he the, he set it up. Yeah, just this, 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 right, this, just watch it. and see. One more topic for trending. What we have? Okay, so Mr. Jeffrey Dahmer. So <laughs> I don't even understand, but Jeffrey Dahmer has a pizza with finger and eyeball toppings at a um Jeffrey Dahmer low, a place at a pizza place in some city. Okay, in he Texas. <laughs> <laughs> not supposed to say that. <laughs> um, so, blame it on Halloween or Netflix or both, but a Texas pizzeria is cutting off a slice of ghoulish Jeffrey Dahmer fascination, which is pissing off some people and drawing others into the joint. Capital Pizza in Lumbach is now uh, proudly displaying an almost literal hot Let mess. It. What'd I say? Lumbach. Oh. It's, oh, yeah. <laughs> no, I saw Wait, him. You Look know why you. she know that? Because that's Look Texas. Uh, yeah. She don't have Lubbock. to. Yes. How you say it? Lubbock. Lubbock. Okay. Yeah, Lumbach. Yeah. <laughs> like, I don't know how that's 20 miles right outside yeah. of Dallas. L- Lumbach. <laughs> I thought no, so. I yeah, my bad. That's um, what it is, man. It's it called would a, be this crazy story. <laughs> it's called the Jeffrey Dahmer uh, special. Yes, that's a finger and an eyeball surrounded by uh, what looks like blood. That don't even look good. He said the pie is just ramen noodles, pepperoni, and pepperoni garnish, and along with prop body parts and a whole lot of fake blood. Even though it's not on the menu, it's just a prop in the piece uh, in the pizzeria window. Who Many this customers was a good idea. have complained in its poor taste. You no pun also, intended. You know they also turned hit the story that's on Netflix into a TV series about when he was a high school student. Wait, they got like no, three didn't. different they, shows yeah, about on him. Netflix. Yeah. No, I don't think it's on Netflix. I they think got they got else. the actual thing, then they got the re the, the remake or the documentary. Yeah. Then they got a series. It's like about why when he was in high Dumbass school stuff? as yeah. a pre I guess why killer. Do we why know why that? A pre killer. A pre- that's what you call. Why do we need to know that? Yeah. Pre-K. 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 Pre-K is a pre-killer. Okay. We're Wait, done. Man, pre-K. Yeah. <laughs> yes, thank you. Yeah. That was right on time. Because that was going down the wrong road. What I say? That was just you called like, a why? pre-killer. Yeah, why? There's a story about him as a pre-killer. Pre-K. Yeah. And he was a pre-K. Yeah, okay. why? 
Anyway, hey man, like and share. Everything came together in the